To integrate Shopify with Convertry, you'll need to make a private app within your Shopify account. Luckily, it's easy. So first, create an app in Shopify. Head to shopify.com and log in using your credentials. Next, click on Apps in the left-hand menu. Scroll to find Manage Private Apps and click this link. Then click to add a new private app. In the Name field, enter a name that's easy to remember. Convertry is a good idea. Next, set all admin API fields to read and write access using the dropdowns. Finally, check the box to mark Allow this app to access your storefront data using the storefront API. Then click Save. You'll be taken to the app's page. Scroll and find your storefront access token and copy it to the clipboard. Next, you'll need to make a note of your app ID and store handle. The URL of your app's page should look something like this. So this part is your store handle, and this part is your store ID. Keep this tab open or make a note of them. So next, you'll need to connect your new Shopify app with Convertry. So in the Convertry dashboard, click on Account, then click Integrations. Scroll to Find General, and click Setup over the Shopify logo. In the box marked store handle, enter the store handle from your app page URL. It's just the name of your Shopify store with special characters removed and hyphens in place of spaces. In the box marked app ID, paste the app ID from your app page URL. And finally, in the box marked Access Token, paste your storefront access token you copied earlier. When you're done, just click Save. Once your integration is successful, you'll see a green check mark underneath the Shopify logo. You can now use the Shopify Buy button element in the Page Builder. And if you wish to revoke your access, you can do so at any time by navigating back to this page, clicking Setup, and clicking the red link.